Welcome everyone to the Dine Sports YouTube page and Connor Bedard Mania is officially here. Inside one of these boxes is a potentially $1 million card. It's already been some bounties uh, released on that for Connor Bedard's Young Guns, one of one. Uh, we've also seen some wild price tags going on as far as some of the Upper Deck exclusives. We saw a jersey match go up on eBay for $100,000 the other day. So uh, these are essentially lottery tickets at this point if you're able to pull one of the uh, big cards out of them. A uh, bit of a nice crop of Young Guns Beyond Bedard as well too. Uh, some nice parallels and uh, finally, mercifully, some would even say Upper Deck getting in on the uh, numbered game as well to sort of the panini prism and some of those other uh, subsets that we've seen in other sports but not in hockey of late so these uh boxes uh, the hobby version are going to only increase in price as you go uh, until that uh, one of one young guns is ultimately pulled then you'll see them maybe start coming back down to earth but the dealer's philosophy is with every box ripped that doesn't have that one of one in it that means you're one step closer to pulling it so uh, what started out as about 250 pre-sale Canadians has crept up well over 300 uh, some of the uh, local card shops are already approaching $400 per box here. This one we managed to get uh, below that price, but still these are going to be few and far between how many we're going to rip on the uh, YouTube page here because they are getting a little bit crazy. We'll throw on screen some of the odds that you can pull. Um, again, some of the staples from past years as well are back in the 2023-24 Series 2. You've got the uh, Superstar Honor Rolls as as well as uh, some new inserts this year as well too. They've got some deep roots and uh, other fun stuff there. You got 12 packs per box, 12 cards per pack. So we're gonna dig into these here and uh, see what we can grab. There's also already the retail tin versions and some of the blasters and all of that are making their way to the market as well too. Down in the States, they ended up uh, actually releasing them a little bit early by accident. So uh, they've actually had them uh, earlier than some of the north of the border shops as well too. So 2023, 24, deep breath, crossing our fingers, hoping for some big cards coming out of this bad boy here. So as you can see, Pretty standard uh, layout for the base cards. We'll get through uh, multiple inserts per pack here. So we got Henrique, we got Matheson, something shiny coming up here. We got Linus Ulmark. We have our Monster Season. So these are all Connor McDavid style cards here. It's pretty much uh, one for every game he played um, in 2022. So this one is Oilers versus Flames. You can see the back of that, the monster seasons there. We've got the instinctive, so these are mostly goalie tender inserts there. Billy Huso of the Red Wings. And then the aforementioned superstar honor roll. This one is Elliot Desnoyer of the Philadelphia Flyers. Okay, and then we've got Eric Carlson, Michael Rasmussen, Philip Gustafson, Barkov, and Nick Perron. All right, pack number two. Okay. McDonough, Philip Deneau, Samuel Girard, Nikita Zaitsev. We got Colton Sizens. And, oh, we got Robertson. And these PCs, they're kind of like the uh, video game version, EA Sports, uh, NHL style. So we've got uh, those ones there. You can kind of see the little highlights around them. That's a new insert as well. Got our first young guns here. We got Stanislav Svozil. Defenseman for the Columbus Blue Jackets. Right there, out of Czechia. All right, so put him off to the side. And then we've got a Brad Marchand. There we go. So these are uh, kind of those outburst silvers there uh, that you can find for the uh, actual sets inside there as well, too. Uh, Philip Hronick. Jason Dickinson, Boone Jenner, and Kyle Connor to round out that pack. All right. So we're one Young Guns on the board. You can expect about six per hobby box there. Uh, Travis Boyd. We've got Jared McCann, Ricard Raquel, Tyler Toffoli, Josh Mahura, and what have we here? We've got a 
Liam O'Brien, director of boards. So this is one of those newer inserts there, kind of the uh, players who are most likely to throw up tons of hits throughout the season. Upper deck canvas of Alex Pietrangelo and a Sean Farrell superstar honor roll for the Montreal Canadiens. And then on the base to finish it out, we got Brent Burns, Dylan Holloway, Artem Zub, and Justin Falk. All right, pile number two. First three in the books here. So we got Brandon Hagel, Joel Faraby, Victor Olofsson, Alex Newhook. We've got another one of those instinctives, Jordan Binnington. We've got, ooh, Connor Zary, clear cut young guns here. So Connor Zary, the Calgary Flames. That is uh, a very, very nice one to get there. And obviously the uh, clear cut parallel to boot as well. So young guns, so this uh, should not, in theory, count towards our young guns total for this box. So we should still have uh, another uh, five coming our way, but Connor Zary on the young guns. Clear cut, very, very nice pull right there. Rest of the pack there, uh, Stanislav is back, this time in the superstar honor roll form. And then we've got Bjorkstrand, Jacob Truba, Carter Hart, and Tom Lindell and Jordan Harris. All right, so we are on the board in a uh, pretty decent way here with that clear cut Connor Zary. All right, let's see what else we can get. Anytime you get the inserts, we obviously want them to be the uh, Young Guns version of it there rather than just a base card insert that really doesn't hold much uh, external value. Drake Batherson, Lucas Raymond, Ryan Hartman, Braden Schneider, Jonathan Berggren, and this is, again, one of those new ones that is uh, in the set this year. This is the ecleptic, or ecliptic, I guess, uh, Adrian Kempe of the Los Angeles Kings. Right there, we got our second Young Guns, and again, another really nice one to pull. Zach Benson, oh my goodness, and we've got another Young Guns behind it. This is a hot box already. So we got Zach Benson on the Young Guns of... The Buffalo Sabres, he scored an absolute beauty of a goal when he uh, got called up in his brief stint there. So uh, Benson, a really good top rookie to be grabbing there. And then on our UD canvas, we got a Levi Marilainen of the Ottawa Senators. So Upper Deck Young Guns canvas. It's going to be a really, really nice looking card right there. Some of the Upper Deck Young Guns canvases use some... Uh, Interesting photo choices, but this one is uh, really, really clean. It looks sharp. The corners there as well, too. I don't always uh, love giving Upper Deck their uh, flowers there because they do do uh, quite a few things that I don't always agree with. But uh, quality control has definitely been much, much better um, this year compared to, say, going back to that Alexis uh, Lafreniere year. So... Uh, we are now into, and again, that Upper Deck Canvas Young Guns card shouldn't count against our total either. So we, sh we could have a very, uh, very nice box coming up here. So we got Andre Kuzmenko, Ovechkin, Jake Sanderson, Jordan Binnington. We've got Mitch Marner on the PCs. Toronto Maple Leafs, PCs. We've got a Deep Roots here. This is going to be a young gun. Going to be a young gun coming up right behind us. So that's back to back to back young gun packs, I think. Deep Roots. Uh, so this is, again, one of those newer inserts there. Robert Thomas. You can see the back there. Pretty clean looking card compared to some of the inserts we've seen. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm not uh, opposed to these ones, but still, we'll see uh, what kind of collectability they have over time. Then, again, a young guns here. It is not the Chicago Blackhawk we were hoping to pull, but we will still take it. Luke Philp, center for the Chicago Blackhawks. There's obviously another center that uh, we would much rather have, a 1995 born player. So uh, yeah, 20, 29 years old turning this year. So a bit of an older uh, prospect, I guess you could call him that at this point. Silverberg, Jordan Cairo, Pionk, Tuck, and Luosterinen. All right. Moving along, let's go to the left here, see what we've got up there. All right. Morgan Bear, Josh Bailey, we got Ferraro, Brad Marchand, we've got a checklist, we've got a blue Dazzler, Mikhail Shirt, Sergachev. Um, again, the Dazzlers are back. 
Um, they do have the colorway inserts as well too. You can pull some pink ones here from the hobby boxes as well too. We've got another director of boards, uh, Austin Watson of the Ottawa Senators, and another Young Guns. Keep them rolling. Look at us go here. Damon Hunt, uh, defenseman for the Minnesota Wild. And uh, he is a 2002, so definitely a legitimate prospect this time as well too put him up there but we are humming through the uh young guns in these boxes so I love it keep it rolling uh robertson neckus uh Ob kubel and brandon sod to round it out on the base all right tally up how many young guns totally hit when all is said and done but still a big name we're chasing out there billy huso jack eichel thatcher demko marcus felino Fabian Zetterlin, we've got a Clayton Keller, PCs, we've got a Carter Hart on the deep roots, I saw something gold, oh it's going to be a portrait isn't it, I got excited, I thought it was going to be a gold outburst for a second there, but we've got a Temi Panarin with the upper deck portraits, they've gone to these uh, interesting looking caricatures, kind of Three Musketeers style here for our friend Artemi, and then we've got Cole Caulfield, Cam Fowler, Vince Dunn, and Matt Zuccarello rounding off the rest. All right, so pack number... Pack number nine, I want to say. Uh, Connor Murphy, Brady, Sky Andres Vechnikov, Zach Wierenski. We got an ecliptic, all right. We've got a uh, another Young Guns coming up. Tried to hide that, but he snuck out the bottom. Jason Robertson on the ecliptic. Got a Matt Tompkins goaltender for the Tampa Bay Lightning on the Young Guns here, 1994. So you can see it's a bit of a mixed bag in terms of the rookies that rolled out this year. Got a 30-year-old goaltender as a uh, prospect there. Uh, Dylan Gunther on the canvas. Jack Quinn, Ehlers, Palmieri, Sturm, and Amadio. To round out the base so we're into our final pile of three last three packs we've gotten some pretty decent luck so far but uh would love to absolutely cap this off with the bedard obviously uh, alexander romanoff mason marchman ross colton jeff carter nicholas backstrom we've got another pcs okay this one is of kirill kaprizov we've got a deep roots uh this one is uh, of our friend Patrice Bergeron. So a little, little bit of a throwback right there. Uh, Brock Faber on the Superstar Honor Roll. Shea Theodore, Braden Point, Delandria, and Jacob Markstrom to round out the base. Last two packs. Oh, as I bumped the camera there. All right. Hopefully saving some last pack magic here. Gotchkov, we've got Gallagher, Bastion, Quinn Hughes, Oh, population count. So these are not the newly stamped uh, limited print runs with the uh, outbursts or anything like that. But these population counts here, these are the ones that uh, will tell you in the top corner. That's how many of these they actually ran. So in this case, we've got a Matthew Nyes 500 Upper Deck Series 2. So there we go. Look at us go here. Population count to 500, Toronto Maple Leafs. We will take that one for sure. We've got a Young Guns coming up, so let's uh, let's get rid of Dreisaitl, Sharon Govich, Dylan Larkin, Alex DeBrincat, Josh Norris, back-to-back -back former Senators. All right, we've got a Montreal Canadiens by the look of it, Instinctive, Carter Hart, and we've got a Joel Teasdale, left winger for the Montreal Canadians, 1999 born, Joel Teasdale. So add him up there. All right, which brings us to the final pack. I've got to do a quick recount of how many uh, young guns we've actually pulled at this point. Not sure if we've got one left or not, but let's hope for some last pack magic. Here we go. We got Jamie Drysdale, Casey Middlestat, Eric Goodbranson, Brandon Tanev, We've got a, oh, there's our sparkle. So we've got a Thatcher Demko 
Instinctive. Upper deck canvas of Seth Jarvis. And what is our final one? Oh, we're going to go with honor roll. Oh, that's a tough one to swallow. All right, Aiden McDonough on the honor roll. We got Trevor Moore, Pilot, Georgia, Edmund, and Miro Heiskanen. All right, real quick run through of what we were able to pull. Got three deep roots, a monster season, one, two, three, four of the PCs coming in here. Some more superstar honor rolls, as always. Two director of the boards. Had the Sparkle Instinctive, along with a few others. Blue Dazzler of Mikhail Sergachev. The Ecliptic, we got two of those new inserts, and another Temi Panarin and Brad Marchand Silver Outburst. Upper Deck Canvas, we had three of them, including the old puppy picture of Seth Jarvis in the background there, where we ended up doing really well for ourselves here obviously we had the population count to 500 then we had uh, levi marilene on the upper decks young guns canvas connor zary on the young guns uh, clear cut and then one two three four five six of our regular young guns so overall eight young guns plus a pop count uh stanislav zovel benson obviously being the uh kind of big pull from the regular young guns but overall eight young guns plus a pop count uh we will take that any day of the week so that is the connor bedard upper deck series two break on the channel uh we might get into some retail stuff but uh i don't think we'll be doing too too many more hobby boxes best of luck in your search for that million dollar card that's floating around out there somewhere subscribe below tune in for more great content coming your way soon